Cute aggression is the feeling one gets when they see a cute object and feel as if they want to squeeze the life out of it. This feeling causes the expression, it's so cute, I could just squeeze it to death. It happens naturally in the brain and is made up of nine main chemicals. The first four combine to create happiness. Happiness is a hard emotion to explain, but in our brain the root of all happiness starts in the hippocampus. This weird word is located in the medial temporal lobe of our brain. Its four business partners include dopamine, oxytocin, serotonin, and endorphins. Dopamine can be described as the reward system and causes anticipation. It is created in the ventral tegmental area, which releases dopamine when we are expecting a reward. The next one is oxytocin, which causes socialness, empathy, bonds between people, and the wanting to cuddle. It is created in the hypothalamus and is released when our neuron energy is high. Another is serotonin, which determines if your mood is happy or sad. This is created in the RAF nuclei, depending on the neurons. Lastly is endorphins, which masks pain in certain situations, causing people to say it's the fight or flight system. They are created in the central nervous system after the anticipation of laughter. Aggression, on the other hand, can be put into the category with the emotion of anger. Anger is caused by multiple things, which include CRH, ACTH, cortisol, adrenaline, and noradrenaline. The process of anger starts when a wave of emotion activates the amygdala. The wave continues down the line where it then activates the hypothalamus. The hypothalamus releases the hormone CRH, which activates the pituitary gland. The pituitary gland then releases the hormone ACTH, which activates the adrenal glands that is located on the top of each kidney. Lastly, the adrenal glands release stress hormones cortisol, adrenaline, and noradrenaline. You may be wondering how these two things relate. Cute aggression is created as a way to get over your emotions. While looking at a cute animal, we feel happiness overwhelm our brains and cause a feeling of anticipation and excitement. As a way to cope with this feeling, our brains send out the opposite emotion so we may be able to heal faster. To sum it up, our brain is telling us to get on with our life. An example of our brain following this process is laughing while crying.